السلام عليكم ورحمة الله. This is Hani Ismail from Planning Engineer website. In this video, I have reached a nice method to convert any WBS to activity codes. Actually, I was doing it manually before, but uh, recently I did some investigation and I invested some time to create this nice sheet in order to help me converting any WBS into activity code in easy steps. So let's go and go and do it directly in our sheet. First of all, we want to go to the project WBS and we show WBS code and WBS name. We only need these two. So I'm going to select the first one. Then I'll go to the very end, click shift, copy all my WBS. Then I will go to here sheet number one and I will paste it here one, two, three. I'll click OK. Now I can delete the first row because it's already a heading, no need for it. And this is the first step. Second step is I need the activity. I need the activity ID, activity name, in addition to WBS and WBS path. So let's go and get it from the Primavera. Go to activities. I need to show here from the columns, activity ID, activity name, then I'll remove everything else. I'll go to the general, then I'll show WBS and WBS path. I'll click OK. This is the columns I need. However, I don't need this group and sort, so I'm going to delete it from here to show only the activity. Now I'm going to make Control A, Control C, or so select all the activities and copy. I'll go to sheet number two. First cell, I will paste everything I have. Now also I can delete the first row because it is a heading. I already have the heading. And now let's start doing some magic. This is WBS path. Each path is segregated by dot. Okay. What I'm going to do here. I'm going to click this one, then I'm going to data, text to column, then I'm going to click next. I will segregate these columns by dot because here each dot will give me the new column. Click next and I'll click finish. This is a message telling me there is already data here, it will be override, then okay, no problem for me. However, you need to be sure that you don't exceed this one because I know here this is I have up to seven columns because if you exceeded this one this formula will be uh, will be damaged so you need to know how many columns or you can simply add here some more columns some dummy columns not here sorry here starting from here you can add some dummy columns okay and whenever you reach you do this step, you find this column, no data, you can delete this column with no data, you can delete and so on. So I'm going to delete this one now. And I'll tell you what I did so far. Okay, so what is this? This formula will give to me the root path of my WBS. So this is my root path. Now, I need to go to WBS to do one more step here, because here I have spaces. So I'm going to select Control H. I will type two spaces. I replace with nothing. I'll click replace all. Then I will click OK, OK. And if I go here, now I can find that I have WBS filled for me. WBS1, WBS2, WBS3, WBS4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and so on. I, I did 8. You can add as many as you want. Let me explain the formula for you. The first formula will get the root path, okay? And it will combine to it the column number one here. Then it will go to search here for the code and get the name and add it here. Very simple, very easy. I will leave this Excel sheet for you. You can download from the link below. So don't worry, you can download, you can modify, you can do whatever you want. After you do this step, now I have my AWS is ready. However, 
because WBS not same as the activity codes. Maybe I have here two WBS levels and then I have in another area three. So if I, I made here if error, if I, uh, I couldn't find this code, it means this activity has only two levels of WBS. So I'll, I will take the level here, the, the level behind, besides, sorry. As you can see here, for example, here, the WBS ended up to division three concrete. So I repeated this division three concrete everywhere in order to maintain the activity code structure. Okay, after I do this step, which is simple in my opinion, okay, this is the WBS one, two, three, four, six until WBS eight. I will, I created for you some nice coding system, okay? All you need to do is to go refresh and refresh all. Now you can see that you have here uh, WBS0. Let's go and check this one why we have error here in WBS0. Showing error here value. See what is this? This is an empty row. So just we need to delete this one. Now let's go refresh all again. I shouldn't see any errors here. So this is the code I need to create in Promovera. This is the name, this is the code. I need to drag this one. I'll drag this one. So here I have fixed codes and fixed. This is the, w, the code name and this is the code itself. Activity code name. I'll drag this one. So I'll have codes for everything once you drag this one you go to activity code and you click refresh and refresh all here now this is all the activity code uh, all the activity id with their activity codes to the end okay now there is one step is remaining which should be done manually unfortunately it cannot be done uh, automatically or you're using excel we need to go to promovera go to enterprise activity codes And I will start creating some activity code. I'll call this one WBS0. WBS1. I will, I will add in this video three. However, the same method you can add whatever you want. I will, I will enough in this one. So I have zero, one, two. For WBS0, I have only here, this is the name and this is the code. So I added one. This is the name. And this is the code. Okay, for WBS1, how many I have here in my Excel? One, two, three, four. So I need to add four. One, two, three, four. In each one, this is the name. This is the name. I can now close this one and I'll make this like this to make it easier. I can split my screen into two areas. Okay, now I can go to again, enterprise, activity codes, now construction and this is the name. I 
here the engineering I can change now the name my engineer project milestone testing and commissioning and here I have my codes And I'll go to do the last one in my exercise here. So how many I have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So I have ten. I will add ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And here I'll copy the names. Okay, that's enough for this exercise. However, you can do all your WBS like this. Okay, let's do now one thing. I'm going to file expo uh, ex export spreadsheet activities. Then from here, I need the activity ID. Uh, I, whatever here I don't need I can remove then I'm going to I made this activity codes project so it be easy to find how WBS is zero one two okay nothing assigned at all but I'm going to assign it now This is the sheet I just created. Now I can simply do one thing. I can make VLOOKUP for the activity ID. Then in my sheet, I'll go to activity code and I need now row number two and exact match. This WBS zero. Double click, everything will be filled. Same here, we look up activity ID. I need now WBS one. One, two, three, and column number three. And exact match. This is WBS. Double click. Last one, WBS2. One, two, three, four. Four exact match. I'll do one check here. To be sure that nothing is missed. Be sure that there is no NA. Okay, very good. Very good. Very good. Now, in order to prevent any problem in the import, I'm going to select all, then copy, paste one, two, three. As you can see here, I have a huge number. I have 2,800 activity. Even if you have 10,000 activity, it doesn't matter. But I mean, Without this method, it would take from you very, very, very long time. So I'll close this one. Then I'll go to File, Import, Spreadsheet, select the file. I'll 
go to this one activities next finish might take some time according to how many activities you have and the import was successful let's see if it is successful so I'm going to use here WBS as activity code WBS 0 then I have WBS 1 then I have here WBS 2 click apply here, it, here we go now I have my WBS as activity code converted without any issues at all. Hope you like this video. Don't forget to download this nice Excel sheet from the link below. See you in the next lesson.